What's up, everybody, and welcome back to another math puzzle. In this one, the question is as follows. 2 to the x equals x to the 32, and we are solving for x. And this is a nice multiple choice one. We got 2, 32, 256, and 1,024. Now, these numbers are going to be crazy to plug in, some of the bigger ones. So that might be tricky, but your objective is to figure out which of these four choices is the correct solution for X. Hit that pause button and see if you can figure it out. When you're ready, hit play and I'll give you the explanation. So here's the deal, because these numbers are so huge, even saying two to the 32nd power or 32 to the 32nd power in most calculators, it's not gonna work, it's, it's gonna kinda blow up. But there's another way that we can approach this, solving backwards and looking at these choices. So we're gonna go start with 32 as the potential solution. So check this out, I'm gonna plug 32 in there and there. Now, two to the 32, we're gonna write that out like that, right? Over here we have 32 to the 32nd power. Now I can tell right off the bat, these two guys are not equal to each other. 32 to the 32nd can't be two to the 32nd. So this is gonna be out. Two of course doesn't work either because you have two squared equals two to the 32nd. Those are obviously out as well. So it's down to one of these two. I'm gonna start with 256 here and we're gonna plug it in. So we have two to the 256 power potentially equaling 256 to the 32nd power. How can I see if these two are equal to each other? Well, check this out. We're gonna use some of our exponent rules here and recognize that 256 is the same as two to the eighth power. If you remember how exponents work, right? Two to the fourth is 16, two to the fifth is times two again, which is 32, two to the sixth is 64, two to the seventh is 128, and two to the eighth again is 256. So now we can rewrite this as two to the eighth to the 32. Well, now to combine these exponents, I say the floating exponents mean they're gonna multiply to simplify eight times 32 is 256. And then what we have is two to the 256 equals two to the 256, which means this satisfies the equation. C is the winner, done. I hope you guys enjoyed this math puzzle. And if you did, please click that like button. If you wanna see more math puzzles on the regular, make sure to click subscribe. Thank you guys so much for joining. We'll see you in the next video. Take it easy.